Hey ladies, I'm just going to really quickly do a video with the mineral pigment eyeshadows just to show you how to get the smoky eye. I've done one eye already just to save a little bit of time um, and done the mascara and that on there as well so that you can see that. It just makes a real big difference. I mean, you can see between the eye that does have it and the eye that doesn't. It's a massive difference. So I'm just going to quickly really run through because the kids are waiting to go out. So um, obviously just pop your primer on. Differences, massive. Right, okay. So obviously the mineral pigments. You probably heard me talking about them before. They're little, little pots. Um, uh, natural mineral pigments. You can use them in your eyes. You can use them um to highlight your cheeks. You can use them in the nail varnish. Um, they're they're very very versatile. Uh, they're talc free. They're sweat proof. They're real, really, 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 really amazing. And the pots only look little, but a little goes a really long way. So they last for yonkers. Right, okay, so they can be used wet or dry as well. If you wet them a little bit, the colour just becomes really, really vibrant. So on my base, I always wet it. So I'm just trying to find the wet brush here. So I'll start with the Gorgeous, which is this colour here. Just pop a little bit into the top. And then just add to your brush. Lots of people use the rose water. I'm just using water now because it doesn't really matter what you do. Obviously, the rose water is the natural toner that we have so just mix it in the top with the water and then just cover your whole lid with it just put a bit too much water in there you see how the colour is just really bright and lovely Okay, so that's just the base coat. I've just got tissue here. I'm just going to dry my brushes out. There you go. And then on the crease, I'm going to use the colour which is confident, which is a shimmer brown. So again, in the lid there, I'm just going to put my brush. This one I'll use dry. Okay, so just go the crease in your eye. Just need something. Oh, we'll use this. <laughs> so we'll just go on the V on the corner of your eyes. You can use something. A lot of people use sellotape on the edges. My kids are just laughing at me now. <laughs> they use sellotape though. And I just like to get a bit of a darker colour as well. This one is corrupted. Also, this one is dry as well. Just on the V. Okay, there you go. And then I like to get a nice... shimmery colour. This one is sexy. I love this because it can go under your brows like this. It's also in the corner of your eye as well which just helps open your eye up. It also can help your eyes look further apart as well. Okay. I also like to go back to the confident and just do a little bit on the bottom layer as well. Yeah. There you go, okay, and then we need to blend it, so I just like to get a big brush, and I just go... Oh. Let's go over the whole thing. There you go. Okay, also well, another thing about these mineral pigments, which is good, if you have the liner shaded brush, if you wet them, then you can use them as an eyeliner as well, and it gives this more of a smoky look, not quite so harsh. Um... So we'll just pop some in there. I'm just going to pop a little bit, a little tiny bit of water. So if you add water to them, they'll obviously be not quite so smoky. So you just have to have a play really and see what you want to do with it. So I've just put that on there. But I've used mine wet. And you just dab it along.
Okay, and then on the lower lid as well. Okay, so you can see there. I'm not going to put the mascara on now because it'll just make it quite a long video, but so you can see, obviously, this is the eye with the mascara on. That's gone with that. So when you've obviously got your lashes on, that'll look amazing. There you go. Okay, bye.